So you do it after. Uh, so before, before. 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 Korean. That's what Korean. It's chapter 19, 8 to 20. You can write it down. Bradley. 자 오늘 말씀의 제목은 최고 이정표 두란노 운동이에요. This today's message is the greatest signpost. 이정표가 뭘까요? 이정표. What is the signpost? What is the signpost? 이정표는 우리가 가야 할 방향을 알려줘요. The signpost guides you where you should go to direction. 어 혹시 두란노 들어본 적 있어요? Has anyone heard of Tyrannus? The Tyrannus is the name. 이때 예수님을 믿으면 핍박하던 사람들이 모여서 예배 드렸던 곳이에요. This is a place where people who are persecuted gathered and gave worship. 어왜 두란노 운동이 최고의 이정표였을까요? Why was the Tyrannus movement was the greatest guide post? 어 우리 말씀을 통해서 같이 볼게요. Let us see from the scripture. 우리 친구들 한국말도 읽을 줄 알아야 되죠. So our friends have to know how to read Korean. 우리 같이 읽어볼게요. Let us read together. 아우리 회당에 들어가 석달 동안 담대히 하나님 나라에 관하여 강론하며 법면하되 어떤 사람들은 마음이 굳어 순종하지 않고 무리 앞에서 이 돌을 비방하거늘 아우리 그들 떠나 제자들에게 따로 세우고 두란노 서원에서 날마다 강론하느니라 아멘 Thank you, Zoe. Thank you, too. Paul entered the prison bar and spoke boldly there for three months, arguing persuasively about the kingdom of God. But some of the many times often, they refused to believe and publicly marry the way. So Paul left them, and he took the disciples with him. Acts chapter 19, verse 8 to 9. Acts 19, verse 8 to 9. 아멘. 자, 우리는 오늘도 전도자 바울의 여정을 따라가고 있어요. We're following the journey of Paul. 바울은 누구라고 했죠? Who is Paul? 바울은 최고. 어, 마테오? You raise your hand. Oh, he believed in Jesus? Okay. 바울은 맞아요. 예수님을 믿고 최고의 전도자였어요. Yes, Paul believed in Jesus and he was the greatest evangelist. 맞아요. 저희가 he was a missionary, 선교사였어요. Yes, Paul was a missionary, amen. 맞아요. 바울이 말한 복음이 뭐였죠? So what was the gospel that Paul spoke of? 예수가 그리스도 대신 사실을 말했어요. He spoke about the fact that Jesus is the Christ. 구원의 길을 선포했어요. He proclaimed the way of salvation. 바울이 이 구원의 복음을 많은 사람들에게 전했어요. So proclaimed to many people the way of salvation. 자기 사람들한테 유대인에만 전한 게 아니라 헬라인 모든 민족 모든 전 세계 사람들이 듣도록 했어요. Not only his own people, but also everyone in the world. 바울이 뭐라고 했냐면 하나님의 아들이 하나님의 아들이 사람의 몸을 입고 오셨는데 그분이 예수 그리스도시다 이 사실을 말했어요. 
he spoke about the fact that Jesus came, the God came in the body of the man, and he is Jesus. 예수 그리스도가 하나님 만나는 길 되신다. And he is a way to meet God. 그분이 우리의 죄를 대신해서 십자가에서 죽으셨다. And he died for us on the cross. 죽음과 사단의 권세를 이기시고 부활하셨다. He broke the authority of the Satan and the death, and he resurrected. 이 사실을 말해준 거예요. And he spoke about this fact. 모든 사람에게. To all people. 근데 예수님은 이제 하늘로 성천하셔서 예수님의 몸은 우리와 함께 있을 수 없어요. But Jesus resurrected, and so Jesus' body cannot be with us. 근데 눈에 안 보이게 성령으로 우리와 함께 하신대요. However, he is with us unseen to the eye. 이것을 제자들에게 말씀해 주셨어요. And he spoke about this to the disciples. 우리가 이 사실을 믿고 기도하면 성령의 충만함을 얻어요. If you believe this and pray, then you will receive the filling of the Holy Spirit. 어, 근데 여기 예수님을 알고도 교회 오지만 성령을 체험하지 못한 제자들도 있었어. However, there were disciples who knew about Jesus but did not believe in the Holy Spirit. 그래서 바울이 회당에 왔을 때 물어봤어요. So that's why when when Paul came to the synagogue, they asked, 너희가 믿을 때 성령을 받았느냐? Did you receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit when you believed? 우리 이거 저번 메시지 때 들었죠. So we heard this from last week's message. 아니 나는 성령의 계심을 듣지도 못했다. No, I've never heard the baptism of the Holy Spirit. 이렇게 요한의 세례는 물로 하는 세례였어요. So the baptism of John was something that starts through the water. 예수님이 오시기 전에. This was before Jesus came. 근데 이 세례가 잘못되었다는 것이 아니라 그리스도를 정확하게 몰랐다는 걸 말해줘요. So it's not that he's wrong, but it's that he did not know Christ accurately. 왜냐하면 예수님과 동일하신 성령님을 우리에게 보내주시겠다 그랬잖아요. The reason for that is because God promised to send Jesus, who is equivalent to God. 예수님을 알고도 이 성령 세례에 대해서 전혀 듣지도 못했대요. So they knew Jesus, and they never heard about the best. Of the Holy Spirit. 이 수준으로는 세상을 변화시킬 수 없어요. So with this kind of level, they cannot change the world. 그래서 바울이 회당에 들어가서 이 성경 세례에 대해서 말을 해준 거예요. So Paul went into the synagogue and spoke about the baptism of the Holy Spirit. 이 그리스도를 믿고 영접하면 성령이 너희에게 임한다 이렇게 말해줬어요. So when you believe in this Christ and accept, then the Holy Spirit will come to you. 그리고 우리가 성령을 충만할 때 현장을 변화시키는 능력이 우리에게 생긴다 이 사실을 보여줬어요. And he showed the fact that when you are filled by the Holy Spirit, then you could conquer the field. 그리고 이 사람들이 많은 사람들이 마가 다락방에서 기도할 때 성령의 충만함을 입었어요. And so all these many people gathered at Mark's upper room, they received the filling of the Holy Spirit. 성령을 받기 전에는 예수님의 제자들은 모두 나약하고 연약했어요. So before receiving the filling of the Holy Spirit, the disciples of Jesus were very weak. 법쟁이 같았어. They were like cowards. 근데 이 성령의 충만함을 입고는 현장에 나가서 담대하게 복음을 전했어요. However, after receiving the filling of the Holy Spirit, they boldly proclaimed Jesus. 이 전도의 역사가 계속해서 일어났어요. And the works of the evangelism continue to take place. 우리 염론자들들 단순히 예수님을 지식으로 알고 믿는 게 아니라 이 성령의 역사심을 체험하길 바래요. So I pray that you just not believe with knowledge, but experience the filling of the Holy Spirit. 우리 성령의 능력을 체험해서 우리 현장을 바꾸는 전도자로 세워지기를 기도해요. So I pray that our remnants experience the filling of the Holy Spirit and stand as an evangelist in the field. 이게 바로 바울이 마지막 사역 집중한 마지막 훈련이었어요. And this was the last training of Paul. No, was it he died? 바로 두란노 운동 전에. It was right before the turn of him. 이제 바울은 계속 계속 회당으로 들어가요. And Paul continues to enter into synagogue. 바울은 어떤 회당에 들어가든지 딱한 가지만 말했어요. And Paul spoke about what type of synagogue what it is. 이 그리스도 복음에 대해서 말을 해준 거예요. He only spoke about the gospel of Christ. 아까 복음이 뭐라 그랬죠? What is the gospel? 십자가에서 죽으시고 여기 말했죠? 십자가에서 죽으시고 Bradley, can you read out, please? 
Jesus on the cross and resurrected in three days is the Christ. Three days is the Christ. Is the Christ. So he went into the synagogue. He went into the synagogue, found disciples, and trained them. 이렇게 회당에 있으면서 세달 동안 하나님 나라에 대해서 말했어요. So he went into the synagogue, and for three months, he spoke about the kingdom of God. 하나님의 나라가 가까이 왔으니까 사람들 모두 회개하세요 이렇게 말해줬어요. And he said, repent for the kingdom of God is near. 많은 사람들이 하나님께 다시 돌아오게 했었어요. Many people come back to the Lord. 이렇게 많은 제자들이 세워진 거예요. And many disciples were raised up. 어, 근데 이 가운데서 말씀을 듣는 자도 있었지만 오히려 말씀을 그대로 믿지 못하는 사람들도 있었어요. However, in the midst of those people, there were people who believed and there were people who did not believe. And this is today's scripture reading. 말씀을 듣고 회개한 사람들도 있었는데 어떤 사람들은 말씀을 계속 들을수록 여기 뭐라고 나와 있어요? 마음이 굳어서 순종하지 않았대요. So yes, there were people who believed the more they heard about the gospel, but what does it say in the yellow? What does it say in the yellow? But some of them? But some of them became awesome. They refused to believe. 마음이 굳어지고 순종하지 않았대. 믿기를 거부했대요. So their heart was hardened and they refused to believe. 아니 예수님을 아는데 막 바울을 핍박했어요. So they know Jesus, but they continue to persecute Paul. 복음을 전하는 바울을 나쁘게 말하고 보니까 욕했어요. So they talk badly about Paul who was sharing the gospel. 자, 그래서 바울이 어떻게 했을까요? So what did Paul do? 바울이 그곳을 떠나서 소수의 제자들을 모았대요. So left that place, he gathered a small number of disciples. 그 장소가 바로 주란노예요. That place is Tyrannus. 어디 있었냐면 서원에서 날마다 강론했대요. So where? They, he uh, set apart at the lecture hall and continue to give lectures. 지금으로 말하면 이런 학교나 도서관 같은 비어 있는 어, lecture hall 이런 데서 말씀을 전한 거예요. In other words, he went into the classroom. Empty classrooms, and he shared the gospel. 그리고 여기서 현장을 실제로 살릴 수 있는 제자들을 세웠어. He gave raised up disciples who could actually save the field. 어, 얼마나 오랫동안 했는지 볼까요? So let's see for how long he did it. 2년 동안 했대요. He did it for two years. 그리고 이 제자들은 브라코에 모인 제자들은 흔들리지 않는 제자였어요. So these disciples were the disciples who did not waver. 그리고 그리스도의 제자, 어. 여기 또 모여 있는 이 사람들을 통해서 아시아 지방에 사는 모든 유대인과 일라인들 다 주의 말씀을 듣게 되었어요. So through these people, everyone in Asia and the Greek heard the gospel. 여기 모인 이 제자들은요 흔들리지 않았어요. And the disciples here did not waver. 아무도 알아주지 않아도 괜찮았어. Nobody uh, was, uh, uh, they did not have to be recognized by others. 어, 너 아직도 일요일 날 안, 응? 나가서 놀 수도 있는데 이렇게 교회 와서 예배를 드려? Oh, you could go out play and why are you coming to the worship? 이렇게 생각하는 친구들도 있을 수 있어요. There may be that type of people. 이렇게 놀수 있는 게 많은데 일요일 날 교회를 가서 예배를 드린다고? So there's many things to do, but you're going to Sunday to give worship. 이렇게 핍박하고 조롱해도 상관없어요. It's okay, even if people ridicule you and also make fun of you. 제자의 축복을 걸어가는 사람들은 언약의 길에서 흔들리지 않아요. So people on the way of the covenant, they do not waver. 성경에 나와 있는 모든 제자들이 그러했어요. So the disciples in the Bible were all like that. 자 이제 바울이 제자들과 두란노에서 말씀 운동하고 현장으로 나가니까 무슨 일이 일어났을까요? So as Paul did the disciple movement and went out to the field, what happened? 치유의 역사가 일어났어요. The works of healing took place. 영적 문제가 치유되었어요. The spiritual problem was healed. 또 정신 문제도 치유되었어요. The mental problem was healed. 또 이렇게 육신의 문제도 치유되었어요. And the physical problem was healed. 바울이 손을 대는 곳에 병이 났고 귀신이 떠나갔어요. So wherever Paul put his hands, the demons flee. 
그 바울의 몸에 철수건만 닿았다가 다른 사람에게 가도 그 사람 병이 나았대요. So as long as the hand touched the man, they were healed. 어마어마한 예수 이름의 권세를 누렸어요. They enjoy the authority of the name of Jesus. 어떤 사람들이요? 주랑노에서 모였던 제자들. What kind of people? Those who gathered at the Tyrannus. 그게 아니라 그 지역의 전체 문화를 바꿨어요. Not only that, they truly changed the culture of the entire town. 여기 이 사람들이 누구냐면 마술가, 점술가들이에요. So who are these people? They were the magicians and sorcerers. 이렇게 마술을 부려갖고 사람들의 마음을 혼미케 하고 예수님의 말씀을 듣지 못하게 했어요. They would do magic so that they cannot, the people cannot hear the word and their minds are clouded. 근데 성령이 충만한 바울이 나타나니까 흑암이 떠나갈 수밖에 없겠죠. However, Paul who was filled with the Holy Spirit, the darkness had no option but to flee. 이 점술과 마술가들이 예수님의 이름으로 변화되고 치유되기 시작했어요. The sorcerers and magicians were healed with the name of Jesus. 예수님의 이름을 높이고 회개했어요. And um, they prayed in the name of Jesus. 복음으로 사람들이 치유되니까 어떡해요? 이제 마술책 필요 없어. As they were healed with the name of Jesus, they no longer need magic. 그래서 이 마술책들을 다 모아서 불태우니까 은 5만 냥이나 되었대요. So they burn all the things of the book of the magic and it became 15,000 pieces of silver. 한 전체 지역의 문화를 치유한 거예요. So the entire town, the problem of the entire town was healed. So it was the uh, amount of money about 50,000 people would make money per day. So it's worth that. 어마어마하게 많은 양이라는 것밖에 몰라. So they just know that it's that amount, that great amount. 이게 바로 예수 이름의 권세예요. This is the authority of the name of Jesus. 우리 렘넌트들이 이런 똑같은 흑암 문제를 껌, 어, 흑암 문화를 결박하는 이런 어, 치유의 역사 서밋이 되기를 기도해요. I pray that our remnants experience the works of the healing like this. 바로 이렇게 복음을 전하는 게 미래를 바꾸는 일이에요. So sharing the gospel is changing the future. 바울의 이정표는 뭐였을까요? So what was Paul's guidepost? 이정표. Direction. 바울의 이정표는 로마도 보아야 하리라. So Paul's direction was I must see Rome also. 바울은 자기 주변 사람들만 자기 민족만 본게 아니라 강대국과 전 세계를 보는 눈이 있었어요. He not only saw his people and his nation, but he also saw the entire powerful nation. He held on to the covenant of world evangelization through Rome. 누명하게, 누명하게 but he was wrongly framed, accused, and then he had to go to prison. 하지만 이렇게 문제와 핍박 속에서 바울은 흔들리지 않았어요. 속지 않았어요. However, Paul never wavered and he was never deceived during the problems. 이렇게 핍박과 감옥 속에서도 보좌의 축복을 누렸어요. In the midst of persecution and problems, he enjoyed the blessing of the throne. 하나님이 함께 하심을 누렸어요. He enjoyed God being with them. 우리 이거 같이 읽어볼까요? Let us all read together. 사도행전 23장 11절 말씀이에요. It's Acts 23:11. 그날 밤에 주께서 바울 곁에 서서 이르시되 강대하라 내가 예루살렘에서 나의 일을 증거한 것 같이 로마에서도 증거하여 이라 하시니라. And let's read it in English together. Three, two, one. The following night, the Lord stood near Paul and said, Take courage, and you have testified about me in Jerusalem. So you must also testify in Rome. Amen. They held on to the funds of all the organizations. So Paul was used as a missionary relaying the gospel, not just the Jewish, but also the Gentiles, the Greeks, and everyone. 
그리고 로마 황제 앞에서도 그리스도의 복음을 전했어요. And before the Caesar, the Roman Caesar, he proclaimed the gospel of Jesus Christ. 이곳이 바로 미래를 바꾸는 길이에요. This is the path to change the future. 복음을 전달하고 교회 후대 살리는 것이 미래를 바꾸는 길이에요. Relaying the gospel and saving the next generation is changing the future. 이곳이 우리 렘넌트들의 이정표가 되기를 기도해요. I pray that this be the direction for our remnant. 지금은 잘 이해가 안 되고 잘안 깨닫어도 괜찮아요. So it's okay even if you cannot understand everything well. 이 말씀을 그냥 마음에 붙잡고 기도하면 하나님께서 깨닫게 해주세요. As long as you hold on to it in your heart and pray, then God will give you the answers. Can I make dosa? Oh. 세상에 많은 사람들은 자신의 이정표 목표를 세워놓고 열심히 살아가요. Many people in the world have their own guideposts and live accordingly. 근데 우리는 하나님의 자녀는 하나님의 말씀을 따라가고 하나님께서 인도하세요. However, we as a child of God follow the word of God and God guides us. 그래서 속지 않으면 돼요. And so, 현실과 상황에 속지 않으면 돼요. So we just not have to be deceived by the reality. 그리고 그리스도의 제자는 언제든지 하나님 편에 서는 거예요. And also, as a child of God, we always enjoy the blessing of the throne. 하나님 편에 서는 거예요. And we stand on towards besides God. 그러면 하나님의 이정표가 보여요. And then you can see the direction of God. 하나님의 음성을 듣고 성령 충만함을 받기를 우리 렘넌트들 기도해야 돼요. I pray that our remnants be able to hear the voice of God. I pray that our remnants. I pray that our remnants hear the voice of. I pray that our remnants hear the voice of God. 하나님의 말씀을 들을 때 하나님의 음성을 듣는 영적인 귀가 열릴 수 있도록 기도해요. I pray that our remnants are able to open up the spiritual ears. 말씀을 들을수록 마음이 더 완고해진 사람들처럼 되지 않기를 기도해요. I pray that our remnant, the more you hear the word, the more you do not be a stubborn. 그럼 예배를 드릴 때 그럼 최고로 드려야 돼요. And as you give worship, you have to give the greatest worship. 내 마음이 사단에게 속지 않도록. So that your heart is not deceived by the Satan. 마음을 깨달, 말씀을 깨달을 수 있도록 기도해요. You pray so that you could realize God's word. 그럼 하나님은 우리를 그리스도의 증인으로 세워가세요. And then God will raise you up as a witness of Christ. 자, 기도하겠습니다. 자, 기도하겠습니다. Let's pray. Yes, let us pray. 살아계신 하나님 감사합니다. Living God, we give you thanks. 알과 같은 전도자로 불러주심을 믿습니다. Thank you for calling us to the evangelists like Paul. 우리를 예수의 그리스도 제자로 어, 그리스도를 어, 밝히 증거하는 제자로 우리를 불러주세요. Uh, please call us as the evangelists who boldly proclaim about Jesus. 불안노 서원에서 날마다 복음을 들은 제자들처럼 예배 승리하게 해주세요. Allow us to be the of the worship, just like. Uh, just like the disciples in Pretorius. 어떤 말과 상황과 환경에 속지 않게 해주세요. Let us not be deceived any circumstances or the words. 하나님의 이정표가 말씀 가운데서 발견되어지게 해주세요. Allow us to discover your direction within your word. 살아계신 주 예수 그리스도 이름으로 기도드렸습니다. We pray in the name of Lord Jesus Christ's name. 아멘. 자. 시간. 시간 갖겠습니다. Oh, it was for recording.
보좌의 축복이 임하는 교회에 예레미야 33장 3절 말씀 너는 내게 부르짖으라 내가 내게 응답하겠고 내가 알지 못하는 크고 은밀한 일을 내게 보이리라 아멘 This is a promise of God. Amen. Um, let's all read in English. Uh, Yejun, can you read in English? Okay, nobody is listening. Uh, Kylie, why don't you why don't you go uh go go with the senior deaconess? Okay, Chloe, can you read number uh this one? The church, the blessing of the throne comes upon. Let's read Jeremiah 33 3. Wait, I that is a covenant given to us, the entire church. So this is the entire church with mommy and daddy. Let's read together, witnesses of Gentile missions. So, uh, okay, Zoe, can you read? Hear that for the terror, I said, what is it, Lord? And he said to him, your prayers and your alms have been presented as a memorial to Okay, JC, what did what did Zoe read? Okay. Witnesses of Gentile missions. Amen. Amen. Um, today it is a new member's baptism. So we pray for uh the new member, Timothy Kwan, Bobby Lee. We don't make fun of people's names, okay? It's God given name, so we don't make fun of people's name. Bobby Lee, Yongan. Okay. And next week, what is next week, guys? Oh, what? Next week? Yeah. Next week? Next week is a resurrection day. There's our, all right. Next week is a resurrection day. So this week, 
This week, we meditate on Jesus dying on the cross, okay? Jesus dying on the cross for our sins, curses, and death, okay? Okay, Chloe, what did we say? What did I say? Isabel, what did I say? It's resurrection day. You said you said something. So we meditate on the death of Jesus on the cross, right? Amen. You did a very good job. Isabel did a very good job of giving worship with all her heart. Okay. So very good job. And also June, um, the medical missions is so for those for those who want to go pray for those who want to who who has the heart um does anybody have the heart to go yes. pray then you pray first of all okay okay no can so i didn't ask can but just pray so we help out. So we help them out. The six people. Okay, and the children remnant, and we have um Sarah, Deborah, and Ye uh Chuan registered for the spring remnant concentration training. So please pray for them, and we have the um, prenatal infant parent worship on Mondays. And um, today we're going to celebrate April 3rd, Noah, and March 2nd, Mateo. So, Mateo, um, we're, so we're going to give a prayer. We're going to receive prayer from our pastor. And we pray for the monthly, the craft session, and we pray for the mission offering. Yes, tell him, Marcus, mission, we pray for it, okay? Please pray. Okay, amen. So that's it. Let us have the forum. Wait, wait, wait. Forum time. Okay, so, and then Ellie and then Noah. Yeah, no. Oh, never mind. Big sleepers. No, no, it's okay. 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 Please confess your faith. Okay. We Brandy, why don't you stand here? Brandy, I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying anything. We're going to keep Put your hand next to you. No, do not move. Okay, yell. Okay, Marco, go to your seat. I need to get my water bottle. No, please go to your seat. Oh, oh this is not a very good recording time. Okay. We listen carefully. We listen carefully to the forum of our friend because there is something get, given to them by the Holy Spirit. Amen. Paul proclaimed the way of salvation. He was a missionary. And the people of Tyrannus were sorcerers. They did not believe in God. Oh, so he proclaimed Jesus. Amen. The people of Tyrannus did not believe in Jesus, but Paul proclaimed Jesus. Amen. Eli and then Noah. And then Mateo. Pardon me? Oh my God. Okay. Noah, you want to get for him? You Noah, got this. you got this. Bradley, okay, Ellie, you, Ellie, you could get ready here. Ellie, you could get ready here. Okay, Bradley. Oh, you have to see how far. Okay, we listen carefully to what God has given to Noah. I guess. I what did I do? 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 What did I do?
Even though like people think that I'm weird because I go to school or you know, not school, I'm because I go to worship or church or this or that. Mm. So, uh, even though people no. Can I just think I'm weird, it means that you're not a Um, even no, though people I keep... think, excuse me, um, even though people think I'm weird for going to church or worshiping, um, I'm still gonna. Oh, amen, amen. Just like, just like the people in Sifka, um, even though the worship people ridicule you, she's going to believe it in Jesus. That's what's given to Ellie, amen. What do you remember? What do you remember? What do you remember? He went to Tyrannosa and proclaimed the name of Jesus. Okay, 예수님 이름을 선포하였습니다. Amen. 예수님. Everyone, what did Matteo say? See, people can't hear, right? Jesus is in my eye. Guys, Yejun is standing right next to me. I can't hear him. He's right next to me. Um, I want to be like Paul to share the gospel. Amen. Okay, Jason. JC, you don't remember anything? Okay, all right. Um, Chloe? Yay. I know that the synagogue. I know that the synagogue is God's kingdom. Oh, God's kingdom came upon synagogue, right? Synagogue is like a literal, and so God's kingdom came because Paul proclaimed the way of salvation. Amen. 구원의 길을 선포할 때 회당에 하나님 나라가 임했습니다. 아멘. 이사벨? 네. 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 Uh, we're going to congratulate those who received baptism, and after that, we're gonna do celebrations for uh, Mateo and Noah. Okay. Amen. Okay, we're gonna pray and end. Uh, we're gonna pray and end. 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 We are going to pray and end. We're going to pray. Okay. We're going to close our eyes and put our hands together. Heavenly Father, thank you for giving us the greatest guidepost, the direction, which was the Tyrannus Hall, where God's kingdom, where God's kingdom came upon when the name of Jesus Christ was proclaimed. May our remnant meditate on Jesus Christ and proclaim the way of salvation to themselves, family, and friends. We pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.